Hi. This is my time to shine. I suppose I've been laying down, but I was like, I don't know if I'm going to get up tomorrow and do any shopping. I didn't realize today is Thursday, I think. Or is it Wednesday? Tomorrow, Friday, Saturday. So, I don't know. But I just want to do some reads for this weekend because I thought today was Thursday. No, I thought today was Wednesday, but today is Thursday. I'm lost in the sauce. But anyway, I be writing down a lot of stuff uh, as far as my tarot. Uh, the, the, to be a tarot reader, like, I don't, if you're not writing something down, I don't know. But it's just things you got to write down. You might want to write down what type of reads you want to do. Um, write it down certain things so you don't misplace certain things or I don't know. I, I don't know why people do what they do, but I write down things for my own personal being. But I am going to do some more tarot readings, but I'm going to do sign for sign. In other words, and I'm going to use cards that I did, I've been using. Um, and I'm also going to use the moon oracle cards. I buy two decks usually of certain cards and then I just put them together. The moon cards is going to basically be my oracle cards. And I think that's the that's what I'm gonna do for um this read. The first sign I'm doing is Sagittarius. Yep. This is gonna be for the sign of Sagittarius. This is gonna be for the next 72 hours 2021. You could take what resonate and you could always leave the rest. I want to see what's going on with the sign of Sagittarius. I'm not trying to make them real long. I'm not going to rush through them. Though. I can't really even say I don't make them real long. But I'm going to try. I do a certain type of spreads. And then I do from there. So, if more cards come out, then I'll go ahead and I usually do the normal nine-card spread with the you know, you know what's crowning. I, it's just it's a couple things. I'm just, I just switch up on every reading. I gotta be honest, and y'all should probably know that by now anyway. That I just never stay the same. So I'm gonna cut and see the energy from my Sagittarius. Overall, is the star something you hope and wish for? Aquarius energy. That's a good energy. So something you hoping and wishing for. The divine is grand. You could also be dealing with Aquarius or have Aquarius in your chart. Universe, spirit guide, holy angels. What is the energy surrounding my Sagittarius? Surrounding my Sagittarius. Okay. You had, okay. Let's see. The way it came out. Supposed to come out. It came different, so. I do how I do. You got the Empress Reverse. Could be dealing with a Taurus, Capricorn, or Libra. Um, this is somebody that's pretty in and out. She got strong intuition. Somebody is upset. You had the Ace of Pentacles crossing you. So it's like you in between of a new beginning. What I'm saying, we'll know which way it go by the time we done this reading. Universe, spirit guide, holy angel, what's the energy surrounding Sagittarius? Okay. Yeah, you could be dealing with a Libra or Aquarius. Libra or Aquarius. How, a Gemini. How can I forget them? I'll make sure this is right. Um... This is really cutting through bullshit with truth and clarity of a situation. Like, you're just cutting right through something. It ain't, you're not trying to go no deeper. It's just what it is. In the past, you had the Ten of Pentacles reverse. 
no happy home, your money was messed up. Could be dealing with Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo, or just in that energy. What is the energy surrounding? Okay. They all came out. Let's see what is this. This is the moon. There's some secret something hidden that's coming out. Being the moon reverse, Pisces, Scorpio energy. You have the lovers. You could be dealing with a Gemini or it's a lover situation. The three of pentacles. You could be focused on building your money up. Maybe so because after the ten of pentacles in the past, you got the eight of cups. You moving forward, leaving a lot behind with your emotions attack. So you could be leaving a lot of bullshit behind. You just punch your back with some shit. One more card, universe. Okay, it gave me two more cards. Yeah, partnership, relationship, friendship. And coming up out of a lot of confusion, which is a good energy. So what I see here without even clarifying is um, Sagittarius, you upset about something or somebody upset in your energy. Or could have been a woman in your past. And your money was messed up. Your relationship, family life, everything was messed up in the past. But you start working on everything. Building shit back up the way it's supposed to be. Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo, energy. I see you got the Ace of Pentacles crossing you. So it's like you in between of a new beginning. But you're not. Is what I'll say. But it's a lot of stuff that was hidden from you that came out. Or you could be doing a high end. With the Eight of Cups moving forward, you're just moving over the mountaintop like Capricorn energy. You just keep on climbing is what I'm seeing. I see in your future, you're cutting through bullshit with truth and clarity. You're not dealing with too much drama. And you got the lovers, which is a decision that you made. See, like you made a decision to be in a love, committed relationship. Could be what a Gemini don't mean, don't need to be. A new love relationship, partnership relationship, or friendship with somebody with your emotions attack, and you come up out of having a lot of confusion around you. You just not be, which is Leo, Sagittarius, Aries. So that's a good read, and without even clarifying, I'm going to go ahead and get the moon. Um, I'm going to get this energy, and I'm going to clarify the moon oracle. Because at the end of the day, it is a new moon. So let's see what comes out for you. What does it have to say for my Sagittarius? Wow, they flew everywhere. I ain't complaining. They ain't hit that floor. Last out loud. Damn, they flew again. The energy is trying to scatter me around. Crack the hell up. I'm still going to get what I need to get. Let me hold these cards tight. Because all I'm trying to do is shuffle. Yes, they are scattering. That's because I don't use these cards all the time. And the energy is scattering. It'll be all right. I've seen a card that don't belong. Oh, okay. Universe, spirit, guys, holy angels. Ah, it's scattering again. Crack the hell up. That, maybe your energy is scattered all around right now. Not, it don't have to be a bad way. It just could mean you got your energy is all over the place. I know I was with a Sagittarius all day. Got on my damn nerves, my son. So his energy is probably all over around me right now. And my grandbaby. Fire signs. I was around all fire signs all day. They all killed me.
Okay. Took me a little time because they want to go or anything. Wow. I was going to say Universe Spirit Guy, and one card popped out for me, like, already, like, this is it. Nothing will come of this situation. Void, of course, moon. So, with something that is saying nothing will come of, of a certain situation, I want to try to clarify. Because I really want to take three, even though it popped out. So, it's something that is no clearance going to come out of a situation. So, basically, just leave that shit alone. Universe, spirit, guy, holy angels. What's the energy surrounding my Sagittarius at this moment? Okay. First card that came out was bring love into the situation. New moon in Aquarius. So it's something that may be going on where you got to bring um, love. Work through your fears. New moon is Scorpio. So you may be dealing with somebody with Scorpio rising. You could. But it says work through your fears. But maybe by the time the new moon is Scorpio, you'll be stopped being scared of certain things. Bray love into a certain situation. New moon Aquarius. You could be dealing with Aquarius. As my son, my daughter. Nothing would come of the situation. So it's something where it's though not nothing going to turn. It's nothing going nothing's gonna come out of a certain situation. So it's like don't it's no need to move forward with something that you like. It's just, it's a dead end, in other words. You feel what I'm saying? So, that's all I have for my Sagittarius. That's for the next 72 hours. Peace, light, and blessings for all.